last week on Odor. Hello everyone, I'm Odor. Welcome to the one week anniversary show of Hashtag Odor. Before we get to anything MBO related, let's see what's in the news. A Yahoo.com report late last week stated that the new Team USA jerseys for the Olympics were hideous. And I don't think they're as hideous as they claim them to be, but... I think they looked their best when they were beating Landlord one-on-one -on -one at All-Star Weekend in Season 4. However, that jersey was short-lived as in Season 5, U-Haul and Landlord wore those jerseys and completely just made me have to burn them. I'm often known as the master of psychology when it comes to the MBO court, and here is one of the many instances of such happenings in this week's edition of You Decide. Do you think Landlord had a sweet dunk and that's it for this clip? Or do you think Odor hyped up a simple 360 jam so much just to get Landlord and Creative Player off the court so he could take advantage and get two more points against Code Red? You Decide. Oh, we need another view of that. Holy crap. Did you get that? Did we get it? This brings me to the embarrassing U-Haul photo of the week. Last week I posted a video of U-Haul singing Britney Spears, which got the following tweet back to my Twitter account. OMFG, kill me now. I think that's a point for odor. This week, however, is not a video. Like I've already stated, it's a photo. Here it is. You see, I wouldn't have had to post that U-Haul, but you keep trying to outsmart me. Like earlier this week on Twitter, I asked you who would win in a one-on-one -on -one contest between you and Landlord. But you thought you were so smart and would say that it would be a draw. So then after that question, you asked me who would win between Odor and U-Haul. Well, since I've already beat Landlord one-on-one, -on -one, and if you guys would be a draw, wouldn't that mean that I beat you since you guys are the same greatest player in the NBO's history? My logic's there. Where's your backup claim?